This week, we update on the Pacific Cod and Pollock situation as COVID-19 delays Alaska's A-season fishing and production and logistical complications in China continue to put a strain on inventories in North America. Alaska plant closures to prevent COVID-19 spread, A-season fishing delays due to extra COVID-19 precautions, skyrocketing container shipping rates, Dalian port closures, reduced plant production volumes and Chinese New Year closures are all factors that will contribute to the short supply and upward pressure on pricing. If you planned on having Pacific Cod or Pollock in your program for 2021, our recommendation is to secure your requirements as soon as possible. With the temporary closures of some plants in Alaska, Undercurrent News has reported that it could be a month before any significant amount of landings are registered thanks to the coronavirus pandemic. Pacific cod harvest in Alaska's Bering Sea and Aleutian Islands and Gulf of Alaska are showing about 13,000 metric tons as of January 23rd, trailing slightly behind the pace in 2020, where 23,000 metric tons were harvested by February 1st, 2020. According to NOAA Fisheries Federal Register documents, the final 2021 total allowable catch for Alaska Pacific cod is about 113,000 metric tons compared to 154,000 metric tons in 2020. Pollock harvests in Alaska's Bering Sea and Aleutian Islands and Gulf of Alaska are showing about 2,900 metric tons as of January 23rd, well below the pace in 2020 where 99,000 metric tons were harvested by February 1st, 2020. NOAA Fisheries' final 2021 total allowable catch for Alaska Pollock is about 1.58 million metric tons compared to 1.55 million metric tons in 2020. Moving on to China and production plants are still unable to supply enough product to meet rising demand as Chinese New Year closures loom right in front of the industry as well. As ports are still experiencing heavy delays, we are hearing that boats loaded with raw materials for China have been anchored waiting to offload for over six weeks now. At the time of reporting, we have also heard there may be 30,000 metric tons of Pollock waiting to be offloaded to ports. If supply issues are not enough, container shipping rates have more than doubled in the past month and are up six to seven times the prices seen a year ago, with no signs of dropping, according to Undercurrent News. Some example of rates that we have experienced from Dalian, China are $6,200 US to ship to Boston now instead of $4,700 and $4,300 to Seattle instead of $3,200 back in October. Our recommendation again is to secure your Alaska cod and pollock requirements now. As such, Tradex is currently still in a great position to supply cod and pollock with inventories of both already in hubs across North America. Be sure to check out our Tradex Live Seafood Marketplace platform for all available offerings. Last week we featured an incredible offer on Pacific Cod Loins which moved extremely quickly, confirming that the market is still in high demand for Pacific Cod. As for Pollock, be sure to check out our Clean Protein Sinbad Gold Pollock Blends. Take a look at this video. Selling Points Power Minutes. Sinbad Gold Pollock Loins, a clean protein. With buzzwords like gluten-free or responsibly sourced, restaurants can also add clean protein next to their Pollock on their menus. What does it mean to be a clean protein? A clean protein is a completely unaltered, 100% all-natural product. Sinbad Gold Pollock Loins contain absolutely zero additives, chemicals, or preservatives. When cooked, there's zero shrink from fillers and the product doesn't fall apart. This means that the restaurant gets exactly the amount of fish they paid for, resulting in accurate profit margins and a product that consistently delivers on quality, flavor, and texture. Contact your Tradex Foods representative to schedule a demo. If you are not already, be sure to subscribe to our 3 Minute Market Insight using the sign up form below to keep tuned in to all upcoming Market Insights. Thank you for joining me for the Tradex Foods 3 Minute Market Insight. This has been Kyla Ganton reminding you to stay safe, buy smart, and eat more seafood.